This is such a ratchet um hair tutorial. Not even hair tutorial, just like it right away. But it's realistic. And it's me. And that's all I bring to my channel, okay? AK. guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl asha kosh back in the game with a new video if you're new to my channel don't forget to like comment and subscribe so you're notified every time your girl makes a post so yes you guys your girl is sponsored today with genius wigs this is the hair that i got from them and i am absolutely in love do you guys see these highlights like i didn't highlight this wig girl it came like this i have the only thing i did was install it and it's just giving everything that it needs to give and it's just I feel like Beyonce in this hair. I'm feeling I'm feeling the vibe. And if you guys are feeling the vibe, stay tuned this video and let's get started. But what is up you guys? I know it's like been forever since I did like a get ready with me. And girl, today we're gonna focus on the hair, not so much of the face. I did install this wig yesterday because, you know, I feel like everybody knows how to install a wig and you definitely don't need to watch me install a wig because I'm just not that girl. Like, a uh, makeup tutorial, I'm that girl. You know, joke tutorial, I'm that girl. But just hair, we're still working on it. Like, I'm really trying to be good. That's why I haven't been going to getting my hair done like I typically do. Like, I'm a typical... You know, I'm going to book that appointment type of girl, but like I genuinely feel like I should know how to do a wig and be good at it because I see all these people doing wigs on Instagram. I'm just like, it looks simple. Glue the, you know, cap down, glue, glue, put glue on the lace, clean it, you know, bada boom, bada bang, lay that shit, slay that shit. But, you know, I don't know. Y'all comment down below what y'all think I did. You know, how was it? Like, I do really much like it like this. But I'm kind of like wanting to try, like I'm thinking like a swoop bang. Okay, follow me y'all. And you know, a little half up, half down situation I feel like, or just even like a half down, half up situation. Cause I've never really tried that on my own. And I feel like the way these highlights are set up, it will just look so cute. Like, I don't know, I think it's gonna give, so. That's what we're going to try to do a tint today. Like I said, I installed this wig yesterday and I like how I installed it. So I was like, you know what? I want to do something different. Like, it's already different because, you know, I installed it. But, like, actually putting a hairstyle with the wig. And, I don't know, come bring y'all along to this journey. Um, I typically watch a couple of hair videos before I just start winging it, but you know, I didn't this time <laughs> and it was cause I was like, it can't be, it really shouldn't be that hard. I did the hard part yesterday, which was like, you know, installing the wig, like installing the wig is definitely one of the hardest parts of doing hair in general. I mean, you see, I got this big ass chunk. I'm like, do I want to use this big ass chunk for my little, my bang? But I'm like, do I even want to like, like, I'm just mapping it out. I feel like where I go wrong is I just be trying to wing it without like making sure that this is what I want to do or if this even is it, you know? I just be like, let's just do it. And you know, today, girl, we're not doing that. We're gonna actually, Map it out and hopefully we won't have no tracks showing in the back it doesn't feel like it so that's that's a good that means we're on, we on to a good start and i'm definitely going to turn on this hot i mean it's already looking decent i'm not even going to cap y'all out like it's already looking pretty darn good and I think I'm gonna do a high pony. Should I curl this? I wish I was on live to like get y'all real like real life suggestions if I should like curl it or keep it like a straight. Cause like I really, as you guys can see, I straighten this wig. Like 
I never typically strain a wig on the mannequin head and like this round, I did that. Like I really trying to get better at this. Like I'm dead ass trying to be, I'm not trying to be the next Eric and Tay, but I'm just trying to be the next Asha Kosh when it comes to just installing my wig. Cause like I said, I just feel like, like it's handicapping me that I can't embody it like these girls I be seeing on Instagram. And I see literally everybody and their mama buying a wig install. And it's just like, I've been in wigs way too long to not be buying it. So we gonna try today. Once I get it all together, I think this will be cute. Give me very much prep girl vibes. Let me change my shirt, because I, I genuinely didn't want to even start with this shirt on. So I'm gonna go do a little outfit change and I'll be right back. Alrighty, my titties are titting. I'm not even gonna lie in this shirt. Let me show you how this shirt, cause it's super cute. Like, it's like a corset. It also gives me that little, you know, I don't know. I like it and I love the bracelet. I got this from my girl Viva Loca. Hopefully I said that name right, her, her shop name right. But um, I'm gonna put it in the description. I think it just gives, like, it's giving that girl, it's giving rich and expensive. And that's why I want to have this hair half up, half down, because it's giving rich and expensive vibes. I think all blondes have much more fun than these brown highlights. Like, it's giving re um, Beyonce. It's definitely giving Beyonce. You can't jump me out. I'm sorry, I had to do a little snack break. This is such a ratchet um, hair tutorial. Not even hair tutorial, just like it right away. But it's realistic. And it's me. And that's all I bring to my channel, okay? Me and Ty starring a couple show. Because a couple y'all are like, don't do it. A couple of y'all are excited about it. I'm genuinely excited about it. Because, you know, if you don't know, uh, me and Ty are moving together, moving out together in um, October. We're trying to get a house. Um, and this is going to be a different process because, like, again, I've never, never, ever in my life tried to get a house. And I'm really excited because, like, I always like envisioned me living in a house, but me 23. No, I, I buy October. I won't be 23. I'll be 24. But 24 in a house, bitch, is giving giving that bitch. Okay. Like, I really thought I'd be single for a minute, but like, girl has a boyfriend. Like, life is really looking up for me, and I'm 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 like happy for me. I mean, as I should. Like, I shouldn't be like definitely shouldn't be upset about my life I, like i'm happy but i feel like people think i've been depressed because i haven't been posting on social media it's just like i it's not that i it's like i don't think instagram i might have be stopped his live i might be getting a call from him soon did he end his life yep see i'm a disappointed girlfriend and i know my man why'd you end your live babe i was um watching it while i was doing my hair Oh, okay. When are you going to the basketball and stuff? Uh, eight. Oh, you going somewhere different than your place? Mm -hmm. Or where are you going? Georgia Tech. What you about to do? I'm doing my hair and recording and stuff. Me doing my hair. You by yourself? Yeah, I'm by myself. I'm at my house. You about to leave? No, why? No, just ask. No, you want to say hi to the people? Mm -hmm. What's up, people? I'm going to the gym so my girl don't think I'm fat. Mm-hmm. Well, you need to do more than that to make convince me that you're not fat. Should I do, like, I'm thinking I want to do, like, a half up, half down type of style. What you think? And then, like, swoop the bangs. What you think? Uh, or just keep it how it was. How it was. Really? Yeah, I liked it like that. Just down? Mm hmm I was trying to do something different. Yeah, do something different too. I'm gonna say you could always put it back. Nah, not really, because the way it was gonna be set up, it wasn't gonna like I'm gonna have to keep it that way. So what if I just do a swoop and just keep it down? How about that? Okay. Is that cute? Or mm -hmm. not? Cute? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like swoop it and then keep it down. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I'll figure it out. 
Man, my boyfriend's giving me other suggestions, y'all. I was trying to do something different, but now he's saying, you know, keep it basic. He liked it how I was. And, you know, I'm the type of person to listen to my man because he's the one looking at me all the time. So, therefore, I'm going to make sure he like what I like or he like what I yeah, like. Yeah, that's why you got me going to the gym because obviously you don't like what you're looking at. Yeah, I got to make sure my baby, you know, is fine. Like, I'm fine. You got to be fine. Like, it can't, you can't, I can't be looking good and you not look good. Like, that's crazy. I'd rather him, you know, like what I like or like what I look like. Let me see what my daddy doing today, y'all, because I can go on a little date with my dad. <laughs> me trying to find some plans. But like, what you doing today? Me texting my dad, what you doing today? I, as if he's not at work. He gonna be like, bitch, work. <laughs> he's gonna be like, girl, I'm gonna, I'm at work, working. Like, it's just like I'm craving this food, the, um, this Ethiopian food, and he's the only person I know that actually likes the food. So, you know, me convincing him, like, Dad, let's go out to eat, you know. I don't want him to pay for it. I mean, but if he, you know, I'm daddy's girl, like, I'm his only girl. So it's like, if he buys it for me, I'm not gonna be mad at the same time. But like, I just genuinely want, oh, he texts me back. Oh, he texts me back, face. Okay, Petey. What's up with you? Working on the Kung Fu around six. Um, okay. I wanted to know if you wanted to go. If you wanted to get Ethiopian food with me. See, that's how he's talking about he's busy. He always thing is my if you don't know, I don't know if I told YouTube, but my dad like does kung fu. Like he actually does kung fu. Like he went to the nationals in China and like even got third in the world for his form in kung fu. Like this man really does kung fu and he does it all the time. Like People, I feel like everybody needs a hobby. You know, I'm not mad at it. I feel like living life, you have to have, you just gotta have to have a hobby. And his hobby is Kung Fu. So this man talking about he's going to play Kung Fu and I'm like, or not play Kung Fu, but go to Kung Fu school and, you know, practice his Kung Fu. I'm like, he might still wanna go out for lunch. You know, he might, I think he's working at home today. Maybe he has like time to go for lunch. Maybe he can do a little lunch date with me. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Like I said, I'm not talking crazy. All I'm doing is getting ready. I might go on a date with my Padre. Who, I'm at this point, I'm, at the, I'm if he says no to my Ethiopian suggestion, your girl might just put on Instagram, who wants to go Ethiopian with me? Because that's the only man I know that likes Ethiopian. My boyfriend don't like Ethiopian food, so it's just like, who? I'm like, I need this Ethiopian food. I, I, I'm, a I'm not afraid to go in and out to eat by myself, but it's just like, can a girl have like company? Like, I don't know, being in a relationship, like y'all know I've been single for like five years, four years before getting into my relationship I am in now, but like, so I'm like, I'm very comfortable being by myself, being alone, like that's nothing, different I live by myself like that's I'm not afraid of being by myself like that is the last thing I'm afraid of being but my thing is like I don't know now that I'm in this relationship I genuinely like company and I'm not that type of person like my my boyfriend will tell you now Asha is not the type of person to be in somebody's face like I'm just just this is just not me so just like but I'm getting more into like being more social like I am a network queen. Don't kid you. Like don't don't kid me. Like I don't be networking. Like I definitely network. I definitely go out and know how to hold a conversation with anybody, whoever I meet. But it's like generally, I generally like to be, you know, by myself. Like I don't need, you know, I don't ask people for their opinions. If I want to do something, I do it on my own. Um, you know, I'm very independent. But I don't know. Being in a relationship is just. Is I can see, I see why people do it. <laughs> I see, I see, like, I like going on errands with my boyfriend. Like, you know what I mean? 
Like going out to eat this fun, you know, with a man. Not to say he pays my stuff, stuff but like in general. You know, I don't know. Comment below, down below if y'all know what I mean. Like, I don't know. It's just, it's also just better to, like the world is changing drastically. It's like, why can't we just like get along and hang out with our loved ones if we want to? I think Ty's really got me into the spirit of like, like, I mean, I've always been a very family oriented person. Like, do not get me wrong. Like, I love my mom. I love my dad. I love my brothers. Like, I'm genuinely a family oriented person. Like, I genuinely like hanging out with my family. And I genuinely hang out with them all the time. Like, um, my parents are literally my best friend. No cap. Like, <laughs> the other day I went and spent the night at their house. I, that was my first time spending the night at their new house. Like, my parents been in their new house for what since May, and and then it's and it's what what's what's today? Is it, we're in we're in August, and yeah, literally August first was my first time spending the night at their house. But it's just like the reason why I don't spend my night at their house because I have I live 15 minutes away, <laughs> so it's like why would I spend the night when I'm literally 15 minutes from my apartment? So. But, you know, it was just generally, I loved, like, when I spent the night, I was like, oh, this felt good. Like, it, it, it was just like, I don't know, it felt good spending the night. Like, I don't know, am I weird? Or am, am I weird to have not done that yet? So why did he answer my message after I had told him what I was planning on, I wanted to do with him? He being real fake, y'all. How you gonna text me after I ask him what he doing, and then like after I suggest like what I want to do, he he quiet. Like like I don't like that. And I would ask my mom, but my mom don't like Ethiopian food, so it's like he's my only option. I have a meeting at two today too, y'all. I'm trying to like, I wouldn't say change my career path, but um, do something more with my life. Like I don't, like not that I don't want to be an influencer for the rest of my life. I love my job. I genuinely love what I do, but it's just like, I genuinely want more out of my life. And I have gotten this degree and I want to use, you know, my degree and use it for good. You feel me? Um, not to say I don't use it, because I definitely use it in my day-to-day, -day, being my own manager. Like, I definitely can see how my degree helped me um, face, do a lot of things that I haven't done. But I could always get better. And, I don't know, a part of me wants to work for an agency. Like, I could see myself in a role at an agency, like, benefits. Like, the, way, the more I get closer to being 25 and, like, getting off of my parents' insurance, it scares the living shit out of me. Not gonna lie, like, <laughs> like I genuinely enjoy my benefits. So just like, hmm. Like I'm definitely gonna be a millionaire. So, but like, I still think millionaires still have to pay for them. Like they, they still have to pay for their insurance plan. And you know, not to say I can't do that, but it's just like, I don't even, like, you guys, I tried to look up how much insurance was so I could be ahead of the game. So, like, before I turn, you know, I, I age out of my insurance plan, I could be like, okay, let's see how much, you know, it's going to be. And tell me why. That was, like, the worst decision I've ever made in my whole entire life because I get calls every day, multiple times a day by insurance companies. Like, it's like they sold my number. And I'm like, what the hell? I just wanted a quote, literally. And I thought they were going to email me a quote. No, they're calling me, asking me all these questions. And I've been told them to stop calling me. I'm like, at this point, I still have insurance. I don't need to deal with this shit right now. Like, we'll, we'll, when, we, when we get there, we'll get there. Right now, we're good. We got the insurance. We got our full benefits. We don't, I don't need this. You know, I don't need this. But, yeah, girl, I, don't, I done fucked up. I'm like, I don't know how. I think I need to go to my, like, What's it called? Um, they said I need, some of y'all were saying I might need to go and um, I wanna say apply, but um, look how silk, silky smooth my hair is like. Can we, 
Can you get a... Well, it's not giving that, but... <laughs> Bitch! No, it's definitely... I'm giving freaking Beyonce, Beyonce. And y'all don't come in, don't come in my comments talking about you do not give Beyonce. Bitch, I'm giving Beyonce. I'm I feel I'm feeling very much Beyonce, Beyonce. Okay. Alright, because this video is getting too long. I'm about to do my makeup off camera because you know after you as you guys can see I slayed the hair. It was all I had to do was straighten it. And it still looks really good. I'm about to slay my makeup and you know come back with my final like thoughts and this is the final look you guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video and got to chill and talk with me and i hope you guys stay you know to the end because if you did that means you really love me and i love you guys too and you guys mean so much to me and i wouldn't be here without you guys so yeah and i can't wait to see you guys in my next video bye Y'all, I just got finished filming all my videos today, and my daddy hit me back up and said he wanted to eat with me, so I'm about to head out and go to, like, lunch with my father at Desta. He probably gonna be like, why you got all this makeup on? But, you know, I'm his child, so it shouldn't be nothing new why I looked done up. He gonna, I'm gonna just tell him I was filming because I, I was. Yeah, now I just gotta put on some shoes and head out. Ooh, I'm excited now. Alrighty, so I made it to the restaurant before my parents got here. Cause now my mom wants to come. Cause my dad was gonna hop out and hop out. I felt he was gonna hop out. But now my mom is coming, so he got always wanted to get dressed in. I, I, we both live the same distance. So I thought when I told him I'm about to leave, he said he was about to leave. He was gonna leave and be here at the same time. But we didn't. Probably to drink out of the same. Okay. Okay. I should.